But you can call me Debbie and it is Friday the best day of the week because it's the last day last day of school this week before the weekend I, I don't know if that sounded right and it's one of the days I don't have work so I have free time and I'm going out to the mall you know go to the mall with my best friend to go shopping and go browse in some stores and then go to a cafe and be all tumbler and sit around so I decided why not why not why not look decent and put on some makeup but this is not a makeup tutorial it is a chit chat me chatting with you i want me to be like your big sister on the internet so i'm gonna give you some advice in this video while i get ready i already have foundation on so i'm basically just gonna be doing eyes and like lipstick but i'll try to make this video at least five minutes hopefully i can get some stuff out because i at least want to talk to you guys i want you guys to be able to like watch me and like connect with me on a deeper level like if you guys are going out watch this and just listen to me while you're getting ready we can get ready together and then this is just should just help you and i want to be able to like as if we were hanging out like this is like our hangout place like we were like this is us hanging out okay so yeah i'm just gonna be doing makeup if you're not into that i have other videos on my channel that are more fun my conspiracy theory videos my reading at who answers my snap test annoying videos you can go watch those and i'm still gonna upload those videos I just wanted to try doing a video like this to see how it was, so yeah. Like, this video is literally not going to be that intricate. It's literally going to be me putting on makeup while I talk. But the topic of today's video is how not to care what people think and how not to give a single shit about anything. Because in high school... Why did that door just close? Guys, my house is literally haunted. Like, my brother's sleeping, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I see the 4 p.m. and the door just closed. That actually scared me, but there's so much wind in my house. Anyways, back to my point. In high school, if any of you are in high school, you know there's a lot of fake people. And I've noticed, for me at least, grade 9, I spent a lot of time worrying about what other people thought, kind of. Kind of, yes, kind of not. I wanted to fit in, I wanted to make new friends, and I wanted to be kind of important. I don't know, I think everyone has their mindset going into high school, like you want to be the top, you want to be like popular or whatever, so you try hard. So that was me, and I cared what people thought too much. Then in grade 10, you started to realize how fake people are. And even if you're elementary, you're probably realizing how fake people are, and I just want to start by saying if you are always fighting with someone, you're always talking about them, you always have something bad to say about them, like your relationship is just not good overall, don't waste time being friends with them. It's honestly not worth it. In the end, you end up not being friends. Really, if you aren't meant to be friends with someone, you will know from the start, your friendship will just not work out and it's just, it's not worth your time. So I'm here to tell you how not to care. Like, not to care what people think and stop trying to force things that aren't happening, you know? Like... I've learned not to give a single shit. I used to care about, like, I don't mean don't care about school, like, care about school, but I just don't mean, I mean, like, don't care so much about others' opinions and only focus on your own opinions. Because in the end, why does it matter what, like, Jimmy thinks about something you do or what Susie thinks about that shirt you're wearing? Because they're not going to be there in 10 years. It doesn't really matter what they think. And also, don't, if you feel the need to say something, some people will say I'm wrong and say, like, no, you shouldn't say something like that's rude or whatever, but I feel like if you have something that you need to say and you feel like you have to say, just say it. Holding back will build up resentment towards someone. If you feel like you need to say something to someone, say it. Because by not saying anything, you're the one who's causing problems because you're choosing to keep those silent. Okay, this is kind of similar to my How to Spot the Fake Bitches video, but more about how not to care. Caring is very useless. I used to stress myself out about stupid situations in school and about friends and about people and about like all these things and if I was pretty enough and like not really pretty enough like I, I'm not being cocky or anything but I never really like worried because I didn't really care like I'm just a confident person overall but I used to like stress over the stupidest things that literally did not matter and then in grade 11 I realized like I'm in grade 11 now like it's a waste of time to focus on things like that like, high school is meant to be fun and meant to just be like a time of like ex self-expression and getting to know yourself and all this stuff, you know, like that. So, it's not a time to stress out about things. Marks, 
Yes, they are important, but they are not everything. Don't let them control your life. Don't let them depict how you feel about school or like yourself, because I mean, they matter, but in the end, if you're not even going into like English or anything that has to relate with English, even though most things have to relate with English, then you don't have to stress out about it. There's no reason to stress out. It's just... And surround yourself with positive people. That's another advice if I had to do anything about like high school. Just surrounding yourself with positive people makes you more of a positive person. And b I'm not like a makeup person, but like if you like what I'm doing, tell me and then maybe I'll do a story, which I probably won't, but that's just like me saying this is like the makeup I do every day. Anyway, back to my speaking. Surround yourself with positive people in high school. Because surrounding yourself with negative people or people who are only bashing others or who are just don't give off good intentions overall are the biggest waste of time and you will regret being friends with them. Or people who are always complaining about things that they can fix and don't want to fix or people who worry about the wrong things, people who are focused on popularity. And I'm not saying it's a bad thing to focus on popularity, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with them because they're focused on popularity. I'm saying don't try yourself with those people because you will start to follow them. And it's so much easier not to care about such irrelevant things like that. My like 100% tip not to care is just do it. Like there's not really a secret to not caring, it's you just do. And I mean fake it till you make it kind of thing. If you keep telling yourself you don't care and pretending you don't care, you won't care. And kind of speaking what you feel, I mean this might be like the whole spoken part of me that like is a bad thing but it's like a good thing. But I feel like it's partially a good thing because speaking the truth is better than just hearing lies. Because why would you want to be told lies? I like to be honest with people, I like to be honest about how I feel about people. If I'm not like feeling someone and like our friendship's just not working out, I'm 100% like 100% honest like I'll straight up be like I don't want to be friends with you anymore like this is not worth either of our time like we don't clearly don't like each other that much and just that kind of thing so you just want to be honest with everybody but yeah I don't know I just want to talk to you guys like you know I'm like your big uh, sibling uh, older sister on the internet even if you're guys like you can get advice from this. I mean, I'm not a guy. I don't really know exactly what goes on with guys in high school, but I just want to be able to like give you guys advice on things. And like, if some of you are going are like going to high school next year, or just started high school, and are feeling the pressure of like fitting in, or like you care a lot about those things that I just mentioned. I don't know how I feel about this. I just felt like glitter on the edge of my eye, but I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> Backtrack. If you're a guy, I don't know how. Like high school is for you, for it's different or anything, because clearly I wouldn't know. But I hope you can get something out of like what I'm saying about how like not caring about such irrelevant things in high school. Honestly, high school time and being fun. People are gonna judge you for literally everything, whether you do something right or you do something wrong. Like somebody, I tell you positively, is going to have something to say about it, about how it is wrong and how you're a terrible person and how they now don't like you. But people are just in high school. I think everyone wants. To to point at everyone else's problems so they look better or because they have nothing else to do and you're, you're trying to find like what kind of people like you want to hang around with so there would be someone who finds something wrong with what you do and oh my god this glitter is lit this glitter is lit like i didn't know like yeah maybe it looks terrible on camera but i like it let me check if the camera's actually recording yeah what else did I want to say about high school? I had a bunch of things that I was thinking about and that I just wanted to say to you guys because like I said, I'm an older sibling. And if you guys have like comments about things like you want to know about, about high school or just advice in general, leave it in the comments and then next time I do this video, if I do do it again, I'll go off comments so I'm not just like picking things off of the air. But this is how I've just been, <gasps> I just dropped my palette, how I've just been feeling lately about the whole idea of not caring and not wasting time. High school? Are is an art is supposed to be the best years of your life, according to many parents and many teachers. So why not make it that? Why spend time stressing over all your marks and all these people, how you don't fit in with the popular people, or how you like didn't make a team, or like how you didn't get invited to that party? 
or whatever. Like, it's not worth that time. Find something you like and do it. And if someone in your life is making you feel bad about yourself, don't be friends with them. Um, I've seen people who are like supposedly best friends, but they spend the entire time talking bad about each other and to each other they still act really maliciously and just rude and like me and my best friend do we do hundred percent of the joke like we're not malicious towards each other but other friends do it like seriously like that's not nice that's not nice why would you want to do that don't become friends with people who make you feel bad about yourself or make you feel like you have to be a certain way because i tell you right now my best advice would be to drop their ass out the window don't actually throw them out the window but just like drop it because they're not worth time if they're just gonna make you feel bad about yourself Oh, I really like this look. It's like glam, but not. Okay, so I finished my eyes. Um, I don't know if you guys are interested. It's just basically like, I don't know how much you can see, but it's like not that important. Like I said, if you want a tutorial, like I'll do it. Like, like I can do that for you, but like, I don't feel the need to do it right now. But yeah, I hope this video like somewhat made sense because I am all over the place like all the time and my thoughts are kind of everywhere I was just hoping this would get through to somebody in high school who needs the advice or somebody like I'll re if I can reach at least like one person I've done something right I just want to be able to like connect with you guys and like I want to be like your sibling on the internet and like I don't know who I'm imitating I've never actually seen anyone say that but that's pretty much all I have made this video about. I hope I helped you guys somewhat. I know these thoughts were kind of everywhere and like it didn't really flow or wasn't organized or anything like my other videos, but I felt like making it. I'm in this like, I'm always in this chill mood with my videos lately, so I have a lot of fun videos playing some public type stuff and some more like conspiracy theory videos and like might do an Instagram is annoying video, so watch out for that guys and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed and like I said I always leave my social media in the description if you want to DM me on Twitter like 100% DM me if you have like need advice like that would be so helpful so happy if someone asked me for advice like I could help you like maybe I'm not smart but like I could like try to help you so if you want to DM me on Twitter do that I also have an Instagram if you want to follow me on there I might start posting pictures more often so look out for that um yeah that's all I have for you guys today I hope you enjoyed. Keep smiling, shining, and remember you don't need a crown to be real too. Bye. Yeah.